All right, Dan, I'm going to show you how easy this is. So you just come to myweebduck.com forward slash user. So you can't see the actual URL, but myweebduck.com forward slash user. It'll take you here. Then you log in with the Josh, like I told you. You know the password. Then the next thing you want to do is uh, come to your Facebook. Log in, obviously. And then to get your photos, uh, just come to your photos. We'll take this one. Right click it, uh, save image as. Just put it on your desktop. But you always want to, well, you always want to name it something like useful, like uh, I don't know how to spell his name. Summer matter. So, you know, we just named it a long ass name. And if you look, I didn't use any spaces, I just used underscores and dashes. Don't ever use spaces when you're naming things, it really throws things up on servers. So, uh, we're going to save it to the desktop. So, with him saved, we're going to come back here, we're going to go to our content right here, add content. And it'll bring you to this page, and it's uh, latest pictures. Add a picture. Title. You want these to be unique when you can too. For the summary, I mean you can type whatever you want. You know, I just put sitting at the at the ugly duck in Worcester, Ohio. I mean it's good to use to use the ugly duck in Worcester, Ohio. Uh, just try to make it not the same thing each time. You know, like every now and then you can just be like Worcester OH. Uh, Google just like this. So now we're going to put that image up here. It's on my desktop. Where is he? I'm going to upload it. Then right here, I'm going to say good friends. Oh, you don't need to. You can use spaces on these, just don't use them in the actual, actual file name. Then you save it. And there's the new page, but no one's ever going to be able to get there unless they knew this URL up top. So we come to our latest pictures. You can see there's the uh, new picture of them right there. So I mean, it's that easy.